Hello, Brian Myers from Winning Solutions, Inc. and the Microsoft Access Experts. Today, I'm going to give you a demo of one of our more popular database templates. It is our time card tracking database. And if you go to our website at www.microsoftaccessexpert.com, you can scroll down on the left side to the database templates section, and you should see the time card database. We'll go ahead and click on that. You can read up and get a little information here, or if you need to talk to us about it right away, you can chat with us during office hours. We'll get a couple of screenshots here, kind of showing the forms that are involved in the uh, time database, time card database, uh, the search form. There's also some reports that come with this database template. There's also an ability to download a demo, which I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna download the 2007, 2010, 2013 demo version. It is important to note that demo versions of our database templates will not actually allow you to save the data. That is how we um, uh, have decided to do our demos. You can scroll down a little bit further if you like this database template. You can either purchase one for internal use or you can purchase an unlimited developer use which allows you to use it as part of a production that you are reselling. So we're done with the browser here. I'm going to go ahead and close this out. And here on my desktop I've got the time card uh, demo in a zip format. I'm going to extract all and go ahead and extract those to the desktop. And now here's our time card demo. I'm going to double click on that. You may get a trusted locations uh, notice that pops up because uh, this is not in a normal place for databases to be. If you need information on how to solve trusted locations issues, I will put a link to a video in the description below that will show you how to solve that issue. I'm not going to cover that in this video. I'm going to go ahead and click open. There's some information here about how you can contact us via our website, email, instant messenger, Skype, online chat, or via a contact form. I'm going to go ahead and close that. And we'll start out here by adding a new time card. We're going to add it for employee one. And it looks like we don't have any projects. So let's go ahead and close that out. And let's maintain projects. Let's make sure we have some companies here. We have company A, B, and C. Let's create a project here for test project company. A, and we'll do another one here, test project two for company B. Okay, well now we've got some projects in there. Let's make sure we have some employees. Yes, we do. So let's go ahead and add a new time card. Now that we have employees and projects, I'm gonna add it to test project. The date we'll set as today. And the hours, we'll say two. And we'll say we worked on an access database for the client. And we'll do save and new. We're going to go ahead and enter a couple of entries in here for employee two. We'll have them on project one. We'll say that they worked on it today, that they had five hours in creating database structure for client and we also have the ability to print these entries as well I'm not going to do that yet I'm going to add another couple of entries here we'll do employee three who's on test project one they were today they put in two hours and they developed front end for database and we'll save and close. And now what we can do is we can search our time cards. We can search by employee. And we have the three employees in there. We can search by project as well or for an employee for a specific project. We can set a date range. We can set an amount of hours. And we can also search by notes. So I'm going to look at the hours by employee. 
And since I have that employee selected, you can see here that I that uh, employee three worked on the test project. They developed a front end for the database, and there was two hours entered, and it totaled up to two hours. So there's your report. Now we'll go ahead and I'll delete this out, and let's do another hours report uh, without any information entered. Now we get everybody that's entered here, and it's all to the same company. So. It's all going to show up in the same location. And let's see if we can look at some of these other uh, hours by employee summary. So that's each employee and how many hours they put in. We have hours by project. Another nice way to look at the information here. We have the test projects. And hours by project summary. Another way to look at our data there. We can also print those out right away. We can also export our search results to Excel. So a very nice starting place for you if you need a time card entry system. We can always customize this database template to meet your needs or implement it into one of your current databases. Or if you would like to purchase a copy and modify it yourself, please feel free to do so. You can purchase it from our website. I'll put a link to, this, to the page in our description below. Please give us a like and subscribe. We post new demos and uh, tutorials for access all the time. Please have a great day and thank you for watching.